With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so the question is the rate constant of reactions at 500 and 700 Kelvin are 0.2 per second and 0.07 per second respectively. Calculate the value of Ea and A. Now for different, different temperature we have given the rate constant and for that we can use the equation ln of k2 upon k1 is equal to Ea by R into 1 by t1 minus 1 by t2. Now we have given the value of k2 and k1. This will be k2 and this one is k1. This is t2 and this one t1. So ln of this k2 is 0 0.07 and this k1 is 0 0.02. And here we have to find the value of Ea. Now take the value of R as a 8.31 because we have to find the value of uh, activation energy in Joule. T1 is given as how much 500 and T2 is given as how much that is equal to 700. Now take the LCM in the right hand side and here it will get cancelled out by how much 3.5. 3.5. So ln of 3.5 is there that will be multiplied by 8.314. Take the LCM. LCM will be 500 into 700. So here it will be 500 into 700 and that will be divided by how much? So that will be divided by uh, this 700 minus 500 that means 200. So this will be the value of what? That will be the value of activation energy. Now find the value of this ln 3.5. This 20 and 20 will get cancelled out. Here we can say this 2 and this will get cancelled out 4.4.157. 4 so activation energy is equal to 500 into 7 into 4.157 into of ln. Now what will be the value of ln? We have to find the value of ln of 3.5. So ln of 3.5 is equal to 1.25. Now we have this 1.25 and that will be multiplied by how much? So that is multiplied by 507 and that finally will multiply by how much 4.1 4.157 so after multiplying the final answer is coming out to be 18186.8 it will be in joule or if you want to convert into a kilojoule then it will be 18.186 kilojoule and it becomes in kilojoule per mole actually kilojoule per mole here also per mole now we have to find the value of a and for that we can use any of the equation like ln of k1 is equal to ln of a otherwise directly if you want to uh, calculate from e then we know that k is equal to k is equal to a e to the power minus e a by rt now we have to find the value of a so a will be equal to let's suppose you are calculating from the uh, k1 so it will be k1 e to the power if you take this value on the left hand side so it will be positive sign with ea by rt now we have taken k1 so you have to take the temperature t1 so k1 is 0 0.02 0 0.02 actually and e to the power ea well of ea is 1818.6.8 and that is divided by R value of R is 8.314 and temperature is how much? 500. Now, the task is to find this value. So, we have to find this 1818 6.8 will be divided by how much? That will be divided by 8.314 and that will be finally divided by how much? That will be finally divided by 500. So, after division, the value is come coming out to be, we have already 0.02 e to the power how much so e to the power this value is 4.3 now we have to find the value of e to the power 4.3 so e to the power 4.3 is equal to approximate 73 so 0 0.02 into this value is 73 73.6 so multiply this value by how much 0 0.02 
so it is come out to be it is come out to be 1.47 now what will be the unit so unit of this k and a will be equal because this will be unitless so unit of k because this is a first order reaction so unit of k will be your per minute or per second we can see here per second is given so per second will be there unit of k is per second so unit of a is also per second so this is the final answer of this question i hope you understand this concept thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today